What's up guys, Spencer23 here, welcome back. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Clash Royale deck builder. This is a beastie thing that was tweeted by Clash Royale just yesterday, or even I think it might have been this morning. And you can go on here, you can put in your troops, your cards that you want to take a look at, the deck, and it gives you all kinds of cool information. Not only that, it gives you alternatives to each of the cards. You can put in the levels, you can find out all kinds of cool stuff, which we're going to find out in a minute. Now, I'm on the Doc Dollars account, so I'm going to put in the original Doc Dollars deck in here, and we're going to take a look at the stats, and then we're going to use this app to find the direct replacement for each of the cards, and we'll see how that performs. By the way, just to let you know, there's a lot of people have problems. If you're trying to add extra common cards, and for example, if you're trying to use archers, don't make archers your first card because it defaults to archers, make it your last card and it will remove your first one. You'll see what I mean, but it will help you. When people are writing in the comments, I can't add an extra common card or an extra legendary, it's because it's the default card that you're using. Put that in last. So guys, this is my deck summary. Average elixir cost 3.75. This is the interesting part at the bottom, which you don't really consider, but I think it's pretty useful. Minimum cycle cost. So that's the cycle. The minimum is going to be 12 elixir. And so I think that looks pretty... Average DPS it gives you, average hit points, and also so it tells you what levels beat what, what will kill things basically in one shot. And here are all the alternatives to each of the cards that we've chosen for that deck, the Doc Dollars deck. I think that's epic. So let's go out with the original Doc Dollars deck now. We'll give this one little spin out and then we're going to go back and we're going to use the alternatives that it suggests and build a brand new deck and see if it performs as well. So this should be, this should be pretty interesting. Oh, we're up against a level 8 MG from Hunter's BR2. I don't think we can beat the level 8, but we'll give this a go. Okay, we're going to fireball the barbarians. Fireball. Was that a good impression of the wizard? I think that was not bad. <laughs> I'm quite impressed with that. Right, let's see if he's going to use the giant. Everybody's still using the giant, really? Get the bombers. A bomber will deal with these barbs at the back. He's sending his fireball. I won't kill my witch. Uh, that app would tell you that, by the way. And we've lost quite a lot off our terror. Okay, here we go. Friendly battle was cancelled. What does that even mean? I wasn't even... What does that mean? What's happening? I've been hacked! No, I'm not. I, I think somebody's tried to challenge me. I don't know how that works. Anyway, we've got to push on, and I think we might get the... T oh, no. Damn you. Look at those fire spirits. They wrecked me. Took out everything. We got him right down, though. We are ahead now. We've got one watcher. Don't know who that is. Somebody on my friends list, I guess. If you're on my friends list, you'll see me trying all kinds of weird decks throughout the day. Oh, what?! Sparky, no! I was not ready for this! I don't have any defense against Sparky! No, no, don't let him shoot! God damn! I've lost my tower! That sucks! God, we're gonna have to get rid of this spy. Okay, tower's gonna get rid of this- He got one shot off! Are you kidding me? He got a shot off on my tower! Oh, wow, he's laughing at me! That's not even funny! How am I supposed to defend against this? Um... Alright, well, let's just try to make sure that we don't lose- Oh, he's, he's also got an Ice Wizard, hasn't he? He's got two legendaries! What are you doing, Mo? Alright, I think I can defend these. I've managed to distract that wizard with these archers so that it didn't kill my skeletons on my witch so I could get rid of the giant. He swallowed the spider to catch the fly. Damn! Another fireball. Right, get this giant in front because I can still preserve this witch who's on zero health. She might be able to help me get this tower down. Uh, I should... Where's my... Where's my bomber man? He's one card away. I needed him, but we're going to get this tower. Nice! So I'll defend this mini pecker with my witch. And there's the Sparky again. I'm going to have to spin it round. Ah, uh, get these archers in. I think we can... I think we can distract this long enough not to lose my King Tower. I don't want to be three crowned. Okay, we got rid of that. Safety. Safety first. We're going to try and pull off a draw here. Because I don't think we can... I don't think we can win this. I'm just going to have to keep defending a lot. I would normally push the other side now. I know I can't get a three crown. He's coming the other way. Is he going to send in a Sparky behind this giant? This could be This could be a bit hectic. I don't know what to do now. I don't know if to just go for the three crown or to try and defend for the draw. What should I do? Uh, I don't know. I, I probably shouldn't have been caught in two mines then. Mini Pekka, I can deal with that. No problem with the Mini Pekka. Please don't send a Sparky. All right, we're in extra time now. You know what, maybe I should have pushed on for that. But he's still got 3,500 on his King Tower. It's a big King Tower at level 8. I don't think I could have done it. I'm just going to I'm just gonna try and make sure he doesn't drop a Sparky onto my King Tower directly. I'll just keep troops flowing. 
down. Uh, there's the Sparky. All right, let's get this distracted. Witch, where are you going? Turn around. Witch, come back. I need you. No. Okay, we've managed to distract the Sparky with my knight. I think we're going to be all right. We are. Ah, oh, we got away with that. 455. Can we hold on? Hey, we're, getting, we're doing quite well in this king's He's fireballed me down to 265. I don't know if we can hold on. 20 seconds to go. 265. Is he going to get a chance to fire another fireball before the end? I, I think he is. I wonder what his minimum deck cycle elixir is actually when we put his deck into that into that app. Probably a lot less than mine. Mine's 12. No, he's got another fireball of 75. No, 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 no. What has he got? He hasn't got a zap. Has he got a zap? I don't think he had a zap. I'm terrible at remembering what cards people have when I'm trying to video these. We got away with it. We got away with the draw. Okay, that's... I'll, I'll take that. Wow, that took a lot of effort. All right, so that was the original Doc Dollars deck. Okay, guys, so let's go and find out what the alternatives were. We'll put in the alternatives right now. So for arrows, it's giving us an alternative. The one I've chosen is Zap. Now, obviously, they're not direct alternatives, but they will do the job. So archers were changing for Spear Goblins, which is a fairly obvious one. Now, the Giant, uh, I'm deciding to go with the Giant Skeleton. That is my alternative for that. So I'm going to give that to go. He's a little bit expensive, but I think we might be all right. So that is what we've got. I've not changed my Musketeer and my Witch because those are kind of my only powerful cards. So I'm keeping those in because I've not upgraded everything else. So I get the feeling we'd get absolutely hammered. There's my deck summary. And you can see my hit point, average hit points have gone way, way up. My minimum cycle cost is now down to 10. So this could actually be an even better deck. Obviously, it's going to play totally differently. But we're going to give this a go right now. Let's see. We've never played this before. A deck invented by Wikia. The suggested alternative to the original Doc Dollars deck. Right, we're up against Killer Princess. It'd be a shame to kill her, but let's try and do it with this new deck, Dog Dollars, part two. Here we go. Uh, level two witch. We've got a level two witch, so I didn't want to replace my Musketeer and my witch. They're my two OP cards that are quite well upgraded for a level six. I definitely didn't want to replace those. Valkyrie. Oh, Goblin Barrel. Try and get rid of that with this Fire Spirit. I probably placed those too late and too far back. That's not worked out ideal, but we're on for the counter. I think we might be all right with a nice counter here. Send in the Spear Goblins as well, just to make sure oh, we got a Prince. Dealt with that pretty rapid. Oh, wow, look at those Fire Spirits. They've wrecked me. I've lost everything. Okay, that counter did not go to plan. But finally, we've got enough Elixir for our Giant Goblin. This is going to be a lot different to the Giant himself, of course, because the Giant Goblin is actually going to fight his way to tower rather than just barging through like the Giant does. So you can't necessarily call them a direct replacement, but it certainly gives you a good idea of what you might be able to use. If you're lost for ideas for making a completely new deck by yourself, I think this app is going to be pretty useful. I think it's great fun to share them with you, share them with your friends and see what they think. And compare your deck to somebody else's. Like your, why, is, why is our friend Killer Princess not fighting back? Why is she not defending? Is she frightened of the, the giant, go giant goblin? <laughs> the giant skeleton? I wish we had a giant goblin. I think we've won this one. You know what? I don't think we can consider that a decent enough good run out. For the Dog Dollars Part 2, that is not a good test. Thank you very much, Killer Princess. She's got a love heart next to her name. Maybe she just loves everyone and lets them win. Well, I think we're going to have to do that again. What do you think, guys? I don't think, I don't think that was a reasonable test. Right, let's do this again. Dog Dollars Deck Part 2. Part 2. Hopefully we can get our giant skeleton working hard this time. Try and get a three crown. Legend KSA from No Clan. Go on then, Legend, what you got? Oh, thumbs up. He's a nice, friendly... Good luck. Good luck to you. Give him the thumbs up. And give him... Wait, what the hell? Oh, I don't believe you, you slimy shit. <laughs> you little sign, he's frozen me as well. I almost... He almost got me then. Guys, in case you didn't... He's laughing about that. He thinks that's hilarious. In case you didn't notice what he did then... If you if you send an emoji and then you do the if you do two like that the person is tempted to reply to both and in the meanwhile whilst you're trying to do your emojis they quickly attack you when you're completely off guard and that has not worked for him because we've got ahead and he is behind that's right you need to cry boy I don't believe you tried that look at our relative towers we won that exchange although I don't know how I was just about to try and respond to the good luck. And I just managed to drop a witch. Then he froze me. He had that plan from the... Why is he laughing at this? What's so funny? Because I've dropped a witch again? Or because you're going to do something insane? Fireball. Okay, well, my witch is still alive, so screw you. He's laughing. What's so funny about that? Send in. Okay. Okay, my witch is... My witch is dead. 
Long live the musketeer. Where's my bomber man? Where is my bomber? He's miles away. Do I even still have a bomber? No, I don't have a bomber. We've changed decks. I'd completely forgotten we'd changed decks. I switched Mr. Bomberman for a Valkyrie. Oh, this is the interesting thing about playing a brand new deck. You forget that you don't have a certain card on its way on its way round through your deck. Need to get used to this. Right, I'm desperate to beat this guy now after what after the stunt he just pulled. Legend KSA. It's no wonder you're cleanless. I never turn the emojis off, by the way. I think they're fun. I, I think they... I, I don't know why people get super upset, but they do rage me into wanting to win. You see, your freeze didn't work that time. I was ready for him with my mini P.E.K.K.A. He's laughing. I don't know if he's laughing because he's got another funny plan or because he didn't get away with it that time. I think we might be able to get his tower this time. Do you think we can get that far? Come on, guys. Push on. Come on, Valkyrie. Come on, Valkyrie. If that was a bomber, we'd have done it. Oh, can they shoot past these barbarians? Come on, Spear Goblins. No. 89. I don't think I'm going to be able to defend my tower for the rest of the game. I think we're probably going to lose it. But on this counter, I'm pretty convinced I'm going to zap you. Yes. He's been destroyed. You didn't. He keeps laughing. You know what? I wonder if some people are just crazy. Or if that's nervous laughing. He's fireballed my witch again. And then he zapped the wrong place because he missed my witch. He didn't kill my witch. Maybe he's killed her now. Okay, so I'm not going to be able to... What do you think we should do, guys? We're desperate to... We have got to win this. Against this guy, we've got to win. Do we push for the three crown? Or do we just try and pull for the draw? I will literally smash something if this guy beats us. I cannot tolerate him winning. So do we push for the three crown? Or do we just defend now? I normally find if I defend, I lose. Here he comes with his hog. He's going to try and freeze me, but you're not going to get everything frozen. Musketeer for the win. Pecker in to wipe him out. That's about the best I can do with that. That didn't work out too bad. I'm going to try and sneak my giant. I knew he was going to place that cannon, but that doesn't matter. Ah, fire spirits. I, maybe I should have had them ready. I probably would have been better off with the zap there. I'll use the zap now. Might be a little bit late. Are we going to push on and get this tower this time? I think we are. I think we've got him. He, yes, the giant skeleton's on the tower. Explosion time. He's going down. Angry face. <laughs> I think it's time to pull some emojis. Let's laugh at him. I never do this, by the way. Crying face. Laughing face. Give him them all. Serves him right. Is he going to respond? He's not going to respond. Damn, you dirty, dirty guy. Wow, I can't believe he did that. <laughs> so, guys, there we go. That's the deck summaries. The original Doc Dollars deck and the replacement that we took. There's plenty more replacements we can get off that app. I'm going to enjoy playing with this. I'm going to make a whole bunch of new decks based on... Maybe you can pick a deck that somebody's been winning a tournament with. Change, change some of the cards by the suggested options. Change it so that if there's a card that you want to cycle too quickly, you can modify your deck so that the cycle elixir is a lot lower. There is a lot of things you can do with that. I think that is a great piece of kit. So, guys, I've put the link in the description. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Please do like, comment, and subscribe. Share these videos with your friends. I'm off to YouTube this weekend, so we might miss the video tomorrow. But until the next time, you guys, take care. Send everyone!